What is art? It is an age-old question. Is it a paint on canvas, ceramics, or sculpture? The fun part is, art can be anything and can even be created with a chainsaw. That's the medium of one artist in the US state of Virginia. Maxim Adams has the story. Let's check it out. Forget paintbrushes. Andrew Mellon is making art with his chainsaw, transforming old tree stumps into masterpieces. He has created over 150 wooden sculptures, most of which are in parks and the private yards of his neighbors in Northern Virginia. Mellon says his aim is to liven up places and add a little magic to them. Whenever I finish a project, you can really step back and, and, and see what an impact it makes on the neighborhood or the community around it. And everybody gets a lot of joy out of it. Jeannie Reimers says Mellon is helping her transform her yard. Because of these um, wires that go across, the electric company would come through and just shave up one side of the tree. And it made everything else fall this way towards the tree. So one of the tree people told me, you should really take the tree down. And I went, oh, no, no. So I took a picture of it and sent it to Andrew. And he said, have him cut it above the notch. And he said, and then I'll come out and talk to you. This tree that I'm working on here today is going to be like five or six different chickadees. Mellon says he really began woodworking in 2012. Back then, he worked as a carpenter and during his free time started carving small figurines from old pencils. Soon enough, Mellon decided to go big and bought his first chainsaw. Chainsaw carving is kind of like uh, brain surgery. You know, you've got to be real careful with everything that you're doing. So you've really got to uh, control this big machine. Today he works with 10 different chainsaws, grinding machines, cutters and chisels. Mellon says he does 90% of the work with a chainsaw. The largest one smooths out the stump. Then he goes smaller and smaller for the more detailed work. He finishes off with a torch to dry off the wood, then sends the sculpture and puts a protective coating on top. In 2016, Mellon founded a company called AM Sculptures and his passion has become a business. Each sculpture he makes costs between three and five thousand dollars. His talent has taken him around the world and he has competed in numerous competitions and a Discovery Channel TV show called A Cut Above, where 12 artists fought for victory armed with chainsaws and creativity. This whole carving, chainsaw carving, you know, world is, uh, has really opened up a lot of doors for me. Mellon says he is doing what he loves and has become an important part of the community. A really large castle years ago in, in a, on a corner lot of somebody's house, right on the, in, on the back side. And kids come by every day, they put little figurines on it and they, and they play. In the future, Mellon dreams of creating a sculpture garden where visitors will be able to admire his work all in one place. Maxim Adams, VOA News, Falls Church, Virginia.